how's it going? It's going well. Super, super, super good well? Good well. Let's talk about Shark Tank. Oh yeah, that's this month, isn't it? It is this month. I tweeted out earlier today and said, uh, like, Shark Tank auditions are happening this month. And it was like mm-hmm. one of our most popular tweets. It was like super engaged, highly engaged. Yeah. Has like 20 something likes on it right now. People want you on Shark Tank. People know we are about to make it on. And so what I've been doing is reaching out to people like Casey Neistat. And we've also been reaching out to some really other interesting, sort of like famous people. We want a famous person to come on with us. It really helps if you can say, and here comes Casey Neistat to tell you how great our product is or brand is or whatever. So we've been hustling to get the attention of a lot of different people Hopefully one of them will come on board with us and come on the show. That would be great. When we get cast for it. It's going to happen. You guys know we're, we are in the casting process when we stop talking about it. Because we can't talk about it when we're during casting. Maybe I'll do a video that says we can't talk about this and we'll not talk about it in the video. Sounds like Because we can't talk about it. But we are way better positioned for the show this year than any other year. Our sales are crazy high we've probably grown three or four hundred percent maybe more since the last time i auditioned probably more than that and we've got you know 130,000 views as of today on youtube we just crossed 100,000 views like a month or so ago yeah and yeah and we just got 2,000 views on you or 2,000 subscribers on youtube yeah it's increasing like crazy yeah we're just kind of killing it so we are positioned to make it on the show. It's going to happen. This year is the year where we, I don't have another year to wait. We're doing it this year. Yeah. So hopefully we can get someone famous to come on. If you guys know someone famous and you're willing to reach out and say, hey, look, we got someone, they're doing some cool stuff, you should talk to them. Make sure that you hit those people up and let them know about us that we're looking for some sort of, uh, we want some sort of household name to come on with us. That's, That's the ideal situation. It's not a must-have, it's just a nice-to-have. So, a little something happened yesterday that you guys might find interesting. You you probably know this. I'll sit on my couch uh, and work on sort of like passive trigger devil type work. It's not like the most active stuff like when we're sitting here in the office. And so last night I was on Instagram and I was just kind of feeling inspired to maybe hit up some of the people that we were targeting for this strategy that we're working on. And I hit up Steve Barra of all people who, if you guys don't know Steve Barra, he's a very famous, prolific skater. I mean, he was been around for for decades at this point i mean i was a kid literally a kid when he was popping off professionally in skating and he's still in the industry doing it doing his thing now well i followed him on the trigger devil instagram i followed steve barra and i thought i left a comment or something maybe just saying hey steve you know check us out or something but i looked back this morning and i couldn't find any type of comment from trigger devils on any of Steve Barra's photos. But I wake up this morning and I check Instagram, you know, I left some different, I'd say maybe about five comments for different, you know, famous people that I think would be really cool to work with. And I had a notification of two comments and they were both from Steve Barra. So these comments, one was double thumbs up, triple thumbs up, something like that. And the other one was like, yeah. here's my email, I'll blur out his email so he doesn't, I mean, it's on the internet. So it's not like, super secret, but just so people don't spam them. But um, woke up to that. Steve Burrow says, hey, and Steve might even be watching this because there's a good chance. I mean, he knows of us. He was definitely on our website. So what up, Steve? How you doing? <laughs> the double eye wink. The double eye wink. <laughs> that was your thing for last week. Come on. Give me your best double eye wink. You got to see this, guys. The double eye wink. There it is. Stolen from him. So anyway, what up, Steve? Uh, how you doing? And welcome to 
Team TD. But anyway, so we'll see what happens. We'll see if I, I mean, I emailed him and we'll see if he gets back. On to the rest of the grind. Today is all about paying bills. Hooray. I'm about to grind. That's my favorite part. Yeah, I'm about to go pay some bills. I'm a bill. I'm going to pay this guy. And I didn't mean that because my name's Will. Don't call me Will. Oh, well, I'm going to call you Bill. Oh, please don't. I shouldn't have even brought it up. Billiam. Oh, What's going on, Billiam? That was almost too funny, but I don't know. <laughs> uh, all right, let's spend money. Okay, so the mic was garbage on that last shot, and so I'm just, I'm super fed up with this problem, and so uh, I'm going to look today to find some sort of camera that we can use, even if it's a cheap point-and-shoot with no articulating screen, just something, because that, it's been too much. But I wanted to talk, <laughs> enough about the frustrations about the mic, uh, I do want to talk about the giveaway. PlayStation 4 Slim that we're giving away, the Uncharted version, <clears throat> and a Cinch Pro Gaming Controller. We have picked one winner for each thing, and we've reached out to each individual. They are real people, they're not bots, they're not fake accounts. Because you know all those fake accounts, they like do all the giveaway stuff, mm -hmm. all automated, and it's just people that are just kind of like a money grab. It's none of those people, so we want to give these to real people, and so the people who won are real people. Uh, they were randomly selected using Gleam.io. It's all on the up and up. We've reached out to them. We're waiting for the, to hear back. Uh, and once we do, we'll announce who won and congratulate those those people. But just to give you guys an update, it, it's happening. It's not you know don't get don't get on the call <laughs> mad at us yet. <laughs> not yet. Not yet. Wait till we end up not giving them away. But obviously we are. Okay, so we're out walking around Rochester, getting some lunch. Just gotta get this guy paid, so I gotta stop at the bank. Jesus. Also, guess who scheduled a meeting tomorrow with none other than Steve Barra, famous skater. Ooh. Oh, I think that's us. It was more me than it was you. I was there. It's the both of us. We're both going to be on that call. <laughs> yeah, we are. And it's going to be awesome. Yeah, we are. So, be on the lookout. Steve Barra, I apologize ahead of time for anything I'm going to say. Because shit's about to get real. All right. Yeah, we're walking. Okay. Yeah, let's stop. Nope. Irresponsible. <laughs> More sand pictures? I am not taking... Well, uh, 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 uh. Oh, this is kind of cool. We can like spin it around. I was just about to say, yeah. You guys are on our little retail display right now. Um, <laughs> every once in a while, I'll go through and I'll just take a day where I email different people in the industry and I try to get in touch with them, make connections. So I spent today doing that. And I came across someone who I had emailed probably like a month ago or so and I never heard back. It's a guy, he's a, he does product development at another accessory, gaming accessory company. Uh, I know at some point he's taken interest in, in my company, but he's since fallen off. And we've made, you know, a crap load of development since then. So uh, I want to get back in touch with him. However, you know, he never replied to my email. So this little trick, shout out to Ryan. I can't remember Ryan's last name. He taught me this little trick, but as a follow-up email, what we do is... <laughs> is we take a photo <laughs> we take a photo a super like extremely passive aggressive sad photo of me like like this one's like me crying like <laughs> like that <laughs> except for I was laughing instead cuz I couldn't stop laughing and then we send it in an email we send that as the picture attached and say I'm really upset that you never replied <laughs> And it works. People, when you send them that and they see the photo of you like upset, like you could take a photo of you like laying face down on the floor, like s something stupid. People tend to respond to that sort of thing. It's, it's so out there and outlandish and silly that it actually works. So who knows if it'll work this time or not, but it's sure as hell fun making the pictures for it. Yeah. So I'm going to go send that email now. 
Just did a little photo shoot of the product here on the floor. Light blasted on it. Trigger Devil logo in the background. And Will on support with eBay. <laughs> Today was a good day. Lots of cool stuff happened. Lots of great stuff. Before we sign mm -hmm. off, any, any last notes? Uh, no. Everything's cool. Great day. You guys probably saw on our Instagram, we did a little photo shoot. Yeah, Go yeah, check that yeah. out. It was really cool. And, uh, hmm. That thing seems to be holding out pretty good. It's getting a little ruffled towards the edges, but we can fix that pretty easy. What thing? The, the Casey Neistat umbrella. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. It's getting ruffled. Yeah. Whatevs. It's all good. End of the Tuesday vlog. Love you guys. See ya. Hit the like. Steve Barrow meeting tomorrow. I feel like that's the only Steve way I could possibly sign out the, sign off this video. Support our Patreon. If we, we really need help getting this new camera, uh, we had more mic issues oh again gosh. today in this video, which we've already noticed. So uh, that's kind of yeah. Please go help us with the Patreon. Please help. <laughs> All right. Peace. Bye.